today I'm going to show you the difference between the front snap kick and the push kick or the teep. So I'm going to show you how you hit differently and in what situations you would use each one. So here we go. Your front snap kick is going to be used in more of like a taekwondo situation. It's going to snap out there really fast. So it looks like this in the air. You keep your hands up and kick just like that. Kick with the ball of your foot. Boom, just like that. Your target areas are going to be maybe right under the chin or if they have their guard up and you can get right underneath, right on their rib. So it's going to look like this if I do it with Bob. So you're here to go right under the chin, just like that. Front snap kick one more time, right under the chin. Front snap kick. Or pretend he has arms, he has his guard up. You're going to go right here under the rib. Snap kick right there. Snap kick. Your teep or your push kick is going to be used in more of a MMA or Muay Thai situation and it's going to be to keep your opponent away or to push them back a little bit. So you're going to put more of your hips into it than you did your front snap kick. So it's going to look more like this. You lean back and you push your hips forward into your kick. And then depending on how you learned it, you might drop one hand to get a little bit more momentum. Your target area for this kick is going to be like the sternum or stomach or chest area just to push your opponent away. So it looks like this when I'm using Bob. So you're here. A couple of tips that apply to both of the kicks, the front snap kick and the push kick, is that you want to do it with your stomach facing the target. So you want to be squared up to your opponent just like this. You don't want to be in like a taekwondo side stance because you would have to be really awkward to come around and do your front kick. It's a kick where you have to be lined up. Also, the other tip is that however high you get your knee, that's as high as your kick is going to go. So if you want your kick to be stomach level, get your knee to right about stomach level. But if you want your kick to be right under the chin, then you've got to get your knee up a little bit more to get that kick up. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for new videos coming out every week. Also, you can follow me on Instagram and like me on Facebook. Those links are in the description box down below. And comment and let me know what types of videos you want to see next. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.